Des Dalton, good afternoon. Des is president of Republican Sinn Féin. Des, how are you? Not so bad, Joe. Were you there last Thursday, wasn't it? I wasn't actually present at the protest myself, no, on Thursday. But did Republican Sinn Féin organise it? Absolutely, yes. Republican Sinn Féin did organise the protest and were there on Thursday, yes. OK, and people can understand, and there's lots of reasons, I understand people talking about militarism on the one hand and the the outbreak of the war and everything that it represented and the role of monarchy and Kaiser Bill and all that. There are loads of legitimate grounds to protest. But why did you decide to shout down our president? Um, there seems to be concentration on, on, on uh, it was a protest and whatever was happening inside uh, I wasn't there but speaking to people who were there mm-hmm. um, there was no intention well you know people weren't aware they, they were aware and knew that there was a protest that there was a ceremony going on inside whatever particular parts of it whatever it was the, the ceremony itself the objection was to and the presence and particularly the presence at it of representatives of the British government um, and all of this in the context of the fact of 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 you know continued British occupation in Ireland. Um, yeah, and I, I take that point. And all, and all of those elements, but they, they are important elements of it, Joe. In terms of no, the why? No, uh, people uh, outside were amazed. People outside uh, received quite brutal treatment at the hands of the Gardaí there, and indeed one of our own members, some of our own members were maced, and one of our own members actually was arrested there as well. And which, participating in what was a peaceful protest. Which, which, but I think like, there's, there's context required in all of this. Yeah, but but I'm, I'm, I, 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 I would have been there if, if I had been around, but I, but I wasn't there in a, in a private capacity. But the, the respected journalists like Peter Morta, for example, who was there, George McCullough, who's director of the Glasnevin Trust, was there. Peter Morta says he reported it, as he, as he always does, uh, impartially, and he said uh, that the protesters shouted, shame, 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 Brits out, as uh, the as the president and the Duke of Kent were walking, and then further, th- this is uh, fr- I'm going from what George McCullough said that when the president was speaking, and this, by the way, is is on the public record as well. You can hear it on the tape that the protesters from your organisation decided to shout down the president. Why? The reason we have we have the we have the question, John. If you let me yeah. answer it, then I'll answer it. It's fine if you you know you obviously just want to maybe give me a lecture. I don't know, and that's up to yourself. No, no one would ever lecture Republican Sinn Fein. I'd be afraid to lecture Republican Sinn Fein. Des, go ahead. Why would that be, Joe? I'd just be afraid. I'd just be afraid to lecture really? Republican Sinn Fein. Yeah, mm. I'm not afraid. Well, when you I, I'm not. 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 I'm
and ceremony and other issues that are raised. However, the point I'm making is, do you stand over the decision of your members to heckle and shout down the President when he was remembering and marking, no one is celebrating, marking the deaths of so many young Irish men in the, in the Great War? Do you support that? I support our protest there on Thursday. Do you absolutely. support the shouting it was, it down? Was perfectly, it was a perfectly legitimate protest. And it was an attempt to um, articulate uh, a view. And that, a view includes, which is not, which that includes the shouting during the president's which, which, speech. Which is an attempt... I'm sorry, Joe, I'm trying to answer the question. You seem to want to heckle me. That's fine. That's your, that's your prerogative. Okay. Um, okay. It's an attempt to articulate a view which is given very, very little space, but it's a very legitimate view. It's, it's, it's an Irish Republican view, and it's a point that's, that's, that's being fine, made. Fine, that's fine. That's two you, things, two you, things. You Joe, stand over things. the... You stand I want over to engage the, in issues. I want to engage over in issues here, Joe. I want to engage in substance. And the issues that were at, at stake here, okay. and it will be at stake in the coming years, is there's an attempt to create an equivalent... Okay, I take... That is a legitimate... That is a legitimate... That is a legitimate argument, but you stand over the shouting. That's my point. I stand over the protest that took place okay. on Thursday. Yes, Thanks absolutely. indeed, Des Dalton, President of Republican Sinn Féin.